just uh, getting some last minute setup going here and um, just uh, getting some last minute setup going here sorry it's <laughs> my sound was going on my own browser I don't know about that song but I figured I'd let a little bit more music play as I finish getting a little more ready here I was gonna play a couple hours of control and then I need to run out and get medication and I'll come back and probably play Wolfenstein <clears throat> this one's called Dreaming by AU5 and Fractal. We'll just turn that down a little bit. If anyone's out there and it's still too loud, let me know. I'll kill the damn thing. love when I look down you can see the brand names maybe I should be covering that because I'm not really promoting any of these brands I just buy them and use them even though this has been pretty helpful <laughs> it's not the same brand as my mixer or anything which goes right into the computer what the hell I like how my uh, tip jar shows the one sub from Dave Testa. I like that little feature. I think it's kind of neat to see. I don't know why. It's not like anyone else really looks at it but me. Whoops. Did I kill the music? Yep. <laughs> I didn't realize that was a hockey. I'm switching cameras because I keep looking at this screen to see some stats. Uh, make sure you guys are picking me up pretty well too here. Where is my mic? There it is. Yeah, I've got my condenser mic on an arm plugged into a 12, uh, yeah, like it's a mixer, a 12 channel mixer. That's the name I was looking for, but it plugs in by USB to the computer. And I think I get some pretty good, uh, results and sounds out of it, you know. just taking a look anyways so this song's a little nuts so anyways we're probably going to go ahead and hop into control like I said I only really plan to play a couple hours of control right now um, and for anyone out there who doesn't know who I am, I am LGN Smoke. Most people just call me Smoke. LGN is my clan tag. I'm with TeamLegion.net. Um, we are a multi-gaming uh, community. So if you are looking for a gaming community full of really chill, nice people, um, we're real heavy in StarCraft 2, but we're also getting heavier with like Rocket League, Halo. Uh, we play D&D, but it's been kind of on the slow end. We've missed some weeks uh, just because everyone's life is a little hectic right now. Um, but there are plenty of games like Among Us and things like that that we're into. We have a Discord, so if you go to TeamLegion.net, you can go to the forums and see the Discord widget. Or even on my Twitch page under the About section, that current widget that you see, the panel with the Discord, that's for Team Legion right now. And in my About page, I have links to my own personal Discord and Team Legion as well, just to kind of promote both sides. Um, I do have my own Discord. I'm still working on kind of getting things implemented in there. So it's a little bare right now, and there's only like a couple of us in there. Um, but I welcome everybody to join it. I hop on in, you know, hit me up, talk. You know, I'm definitely here to work with the community, build the community. I'm not going to run my Discord like a clan, but we do have a welcome page that's kind of like a set code of conduct in a way, you know, just to be polite to everyone else. So. Um, and I have hit affiliate status, so I am somewhat still celebrating that in my own head, in my own mind, in my own way of doing this. I streamed yesterday early in the morning, like 3 a.m., and then again around 4 or 5 p.m. I think it's around 4 p.m. Uh, these are all central times. Um, and I did control earlier, and then I jumped into Wolfenstein 2, uh, new Coloss the new Colossus, and... I really like that people are actually viewing the videos on my VODs on my Twitch. It's actually pretty awesome. Like I had 51 views and I have 51 view, uh, followers. So I think everybody's like watching stuff that I'm putting out. 
Control doesn't get as many viewers, but it does seem some people like to go and look at it and watch it. So I'm going to still play Control because I'm enjoying the game itself. But I will be back on later today is my plan anyways, to get back on later today and actually play some Wolfenstein again, uh, that new Colossus game. Um, it's a lot of fun and, and everything else. So um, definitely want to get back into that. I plan to do that today. Um, but like I said, just for a couple hours right now, I'm going to go ahead and, and yeah, and I'm going to play control. Hang on, I'm getting text messages all the time. Having a little bit of family drama. Um, the people in my family don't really watch my Twitch, so I'm not going to obviously explain too much, but, um, there's just some stupid drama going on where me and my older sister basically take care of our youngest brother. He's 10 and he's adopted. Um, we, my mother adopted him several years back when he was three. My mother, uh, has become sick to the point where she can barely do a lot of things around the house though. She tries and she like goes out in the backyard, overdoes it because she wants to work on the yard and then comes inside and sleeps for days. Anyways, I get up, and get the kid ready for school, feed him breakfast, get him online for school, online now. I used to drive him to school, obviously help him with his homework later if he needed, if he has help or needs help. I mean, um, most times I'll feed him dinner, most times I put him to bed. Uh, recently he hasn't had anybody needed to really tuck him in, but, and every once in a while, yeah, she's up and she's cooking dinner, but she's never up in the morning or anything else like that, but. Um, apparently he's had a bunch of library books out from the actual library my sister helps him with that and takes care of it and so she was just asking me to get the books together and apparently my mother just had a psycho moment saying she had a plan to return the books during when we go off to vote even though they're occurring late fees now i don't know i just backed out of it and now my sister and my mother are just kind of hitting me with shit <laughs> so anyways and then I got, I don't even know if you want to call it Lady Troubles or not. It's, I mentioned it in my last stream, um, there's this woman named Kelly. She's 31, supposedly. She's beautiful, according to her pictures. She has a child, which doesn't bother me if it's true. Um, there's just a lot of red flags going up, and I kind of stopped talking to her for right now because she kind of pissed me off yesterday and I was just like, I don't know what to think about this. I need to take a moment. And now she won't stop. It's just like messages, like books, like tell me about you. I want to know you as a person and I have her muted. So maybe at the moment, like I'm ghosting her, I guess. I don't really mean to and I feel like an ass. I probably should just reply to her being, listen, I don't think this is going to work out. Good luck, you know, <laughs> and just end it. Um, Yeah, like she's really interested in wanting to know who I am, blah, blah, blah. I'd give her a chance, but it's like every time I take like 10 minutes or longer to respond, she's like, oh, you seem busy and blah, blah, blah. And her English seems pretty broken for being someone who lives in the United States um, and was born in Manchester, UK. So I don't know. Anyways, whatever, right? So I want to get into a game. I want to escape reality. So I'll put myself on this side. <clears throat> okay. <sighs> so maybe hour and a half, two hours max. I'll go get medication, pick up some money come back maybe go back on live around like 5 p.m central time just to give myself some time it might be a little earlier and then maybe i'll play some wolfenstein at that time What's sad is not even my Labrador, <clears throat> who loves to be around everybody in the house, 
doesn't want to be out there right now. And there's no fighting at the moment, but I think he can sense whatever is happening. Oh shit, it's still this refrigerator scene. Hello? <coughs> Jesse? Jesse? The fridge is doing something! Philip? If I look away, it hurts me. Wait till I go in there, and it's gonna rape me. This sounds like the board, but I can't understand it. Every time she says board, I think she's saying Borg, like from Star Trek. Careful with that. It's like not enough health or something and she grabs whatever even though I'm aiming at the damn ball I don't really like smoking on stream but I didn't really do, get the chance to do it before I went live I didn't want to waste too much time my room is always so dusty <laughs> Stupid Texas. It's like easy there, but
God, I suck. Try to like aim and fall down one of the damn holes he created. Worm taken care of. Oh, that fucking fridge. That's why you shouldn't get secondhand fridges. They would fill up with worms. like the board but I can't understand it the board or the Borg Keep grabbing something else. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah. I feel stupid because it, like, shouldn't be this difficult, and it's probably not. Just frustrating because I don't watch for the holes in the goddamn ground when I'm trying to aim or pick something up. Alright. Come on, game. you alive if I look away it hurts me this sounds like the board but I can't understand it Fuck.
moving. Pyramid here. Oh, I just get to go back. The fridge seems fixed. Did fighting that thing off change something? All that fighting last night, and I get through it in what? Ten minutes or so? It's awesome. I love taking a break and coming back and being a total badass. Speak with Langston. Let's save it. Oh, I can fast travel, so I don't have to log all that way. Whoops. Not that it's a long walk, but I might as well use this shit. Why am I... There's an elevator down here. Why am I going this way? This is why. Where's Philip? Philip's gone. Something happened before I could get him out. Poor Philip. He never did like fridge duty. But 
If you're here, then who's watching the fridge? <coughs> the fridge is fine now. I took care of it. You don't just take <coughs> care of altered <coughs> items. What did you do? I touched it and wound up in the astral plane. This thing was in there. It was huge, had one big eye. Wasn't friendly. The one-eyed monster. We've been getting reports from the astronauts lately about something fitting that description. The astral plane is usually connected to our world through objects of power, not altered items. If this thing is linking itself to altered items, then it's clearly powerful. This may happen again. Do you think <coughs> that thing is what got Philip? <coughs> Must have been. The Panopticon is a dangerous place. The agents all know the risks. But, since you're some sort of altered item whisperer, I've got a list of others for you to corral. The hiss are causing containment breaches left, right, and center. Here, start with these. I'll see if there are any others missing while you're gone. My life just got a whole lot easier. Ooh, achievement. The importance of synergy. I asked him all this already. I'll see you later, Langston. I'll be here, like always. Dang, I'm reloading, switching cartridges. of the enemy speak with another central unit with her brother. Cleanse and contain the Japanese paper lantern. Alright, first we're going to go back to central executive. I told Salvador. Excuse me. <coughs> I sneeze pretty loud all the time. <coughs> Alright, which way is my brother? Where do you have him? You sons of bitches. Boardroom. It's the worst place. Is purely <coughs> antithetical to every variant of the his signal at your range. But how did you <coughs> create it? <coughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Random coughing fits. <laughs> hey, love chick. I, you're on all the time. No, I guess not all the time. How you doing? Having a good day so far? No, it's happening. After all these years, Dylan is here. Oh, but am I too late? How is he? I need to know. He's clearly been affected by the hiss, but it's different than any other manifestation we've recorded. Maybe what makes you so special is genetic. He was a prime candidate. 
Or maybe it's Polaris protecting him, something else affecting the situation. I need to run tests. He seems more in control, more present. I want to see him. My brother. Or is he? Of course. Now, Marshall set up an HRA warded cage to contain him. It's on the upper floor, up the stairs. Okay, I need to go. Jesse, be careful. Hmm. This brother thing's getting a little weird. Um. I kind of did the same thing, but not really. I didn't leave my house. I called in for, because I'm, unfortunately, I lost my job during the whole COVID thing. Um, there were other factors as well, besides work being slow. But um, anyways, uh, <laughs> legally, I'm not supposed to talk about it. But anyways, um, so I've been unemployed. So I had to, like, call in for my two-week payment uh, yesterday. And I think it just hit my account today, so. But other than that, I've been pretty lazy. Uh, my brother did not have school this morning, so I didn't have to get up and do anything. So I kind of slept in to like 11 or 12 almost. And then I decided to stream for a couple hours. I'm going to have to run out to the pharmacy at one point. Um, but then I plan to come back and stream some more because I want to get my hours in. And hitting out affiliate status recently has just been... It's been an achievement for me, so i um, just been working on that. Probably more information than you asked for, but, you know, there you go. There's the lowdown. <laughs> oh, my God. Did she have to write everything in a made-up gibberish code? Fucking Marshall. CIA Put a record on God. Irish, Irish, ask Irish. I'm Irish. No, I'm just <laughs> is that nearby? Yeah, it's right here. Who's Irish? Oh, there he is. I found this token. Any idea what it does? Ah, that is a jukebox token. Little bastards turn up in the weirdest places, like bad pennies. Rangers use them to activate an old object of power. A jukebox, I assume. I was playing it yesterday, but Does it um, have any good songs? I nope. think what you <laughs> caught me playing was Wolfenstein. Be careful turning it on, though. When it's playing, you get a free trip to the formation. The formation. That sounds ominous. Why does it send you there? Well, Sorry, the hang on. I've been wondering that for <laughs> years. I mean, it's just a pile of rocks built by God knows who, but. Well, researchers have confirmed it's in the same threshold as the quarry. Well, no one's ever been able to map a physical route to the formation for maintenance. So it's in the quarry. You just don't know where. Pretty much. We only send in annual expeditions to the formation now. Checkups, Salvador calls them. This year's team went in the day the Hiss arrived. Come to think of it, the song should have rolled back hours ago. I can go in and take a look. I'd appreciate that. The jukebox is kept just past the security booth over there. Put in the token and enjoy the ride. Yeah, it's actually been a really nice, well, for us, it's raining a little bit today, but yesterday, day before, we've had some really nice weather. Um, but I don't go to the beach often myself. I'm kind of a homebody, especially since this whole COVID thing happened. And I haven't really been feeling well the last couple days. Your last question about the game, um, yesterday I did play Control, but it was around like 3, 3 a.m. my time <laughs> until about 7 a.m. Uh, Central Time. And then I was on later that day yesterday playing Wolfenstein. Uh, and that's probably, I believe that's the one you caught was the Wolfenstein um, that I was playing 19 hours ago or however long ago it was. I only known in 19 hours because that's the last time you hosted me according to OBS. So, <laughs> up in Illinois, right? Beaches. Would it be uh, Michigan Beach? Or obviously, you know, off Michigan? 
I was asleep around that time. Yeah, I usually, I don't get a lot of viewers during Control. I'm not sure if it's a game people find interesting enough to watch all the time. But, you know, I get a few viewers here and there, and some people watch the VODs afterwards. So I kind of play it in the middle of the night if I'm awake, because I enjoy the gameplay. I, I enjoy the story, you know, things like that. Yeah, Michigan. Yeah, I, when I was in Illinois with family, when they were like, oh, let's go to the beach, we went to Michigan. Had, it was years and years ago, though. I haven't been so long, but, like, I remember there being big, sandy-type, like, hills. You try to run up up and get all exhausted and shit. I don't know why I remember that part of it. And I think I got buried in the sand, and there was a bee in my pocket, and it stung me. And I didn't know it was there. I felt the sting, but I didn't know why. And then when it, was, it wasn't until I got back to the uh, hotel room, I reached in my pocket and pulled the bee out. So, I mean, that, that was my experience at Michigan. What's the deal with BlackRock? Oh, there are rocks well, that are black. started on BlackRock. You know, ever since research found out that it blocks paranatural stuff, they have just been parading dangerous materials in and out of the fucking quarry. <sighs> fucking lab coats, man. <laughs> Sounds like there's some yeah. tension between the apartments. <laughs> Still, at least the quarry's got a good view of the night sky. You know, me and Salvador used to have after work beers down there. <coughs> what do you know about Dr. Darling? Uh, about as much as anybody, I guess. Head of research, loves to hear himself talk. All of those science types absolutely do. Uh, now he's been acting a little bit psycho recently. Although HR told me not to use that word, so... Everyone thinks finding Darling <laughs> leads to the answers. But if he's completely <coughs> lost it, then what help could he be? All right, talk about the Rangers. Your security, right? Do you work with Rangers? Not often. Rangers are specially trained in threshold reconnaissance and ground zero AWE response. Security is more interested in the dangers inside of you. They must see some weird stuff out there. Oh, yeah, definitely. You know, every week they are tackling things that were previously unknown to the human experience. Most rangers, they retire due to cognitive collapse. I looked up the medical definition. Not fun. How does the Bureau handle thresholds? Handle might be a bit of an optimistic way. We call you in. Marshall sends rangers in to map them, check growth rates, locate epicenters, take samples. Measure stuff, basically. Sounds like he's done his homework. Now, down in maintenance, thresholds are used just like any other tool. The lab coats mine black rock from one, maintenance siphons water from another. We use it for pretty much everything, except drinking. Why don't you drink it? Do I even want to know? <laughs> uh, yeah, a lot of time we find these little chunks in it. It's uh, pretty gross. I didn't want to know. But I wanted to know. That's something that I would want to know. What do you think of Marshall? Marshall? Marshall's a bitch. Marshall's a fucking badass. Rangers could not ask for a better <coughs> leader. She's a little, uh, you know, intense, but given the stuff she's seen, I'm not surprised. She does have a bad habit of disappearing. Where does she go? Uh, last time she vanished, I did some digging into the security logs. I found camera footage of her entering the quarry. She was down there alone for days. Now, typically that's not allowed, but Marshall is kind of above the rules. I wonder what she finds so interesting in the quarry. Okay, so you say purse shopping again. I have to ask, when was the last time you went purse shopping? Because that's really going to determine if you should be I going go. again. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. Like, I'm going to stop playing until you tell me the last time you bought a purse. I can wait. It's all right. Take your time. <laughs> like, two weeks ago? Come on. You don't need another purse. Like, what'd you do? Beat that one up? Has it got holes in it? You dragged it around like concrete? Like, what do you do with it? How many purses do you need? Like, for any typical woman, like... Just, just 
get a bit big old bag and just throw everything in it. Two weeks. <laughs> I mean, come on. I buy a like something. It's like if I bought a backpack two weeks ago and I just like dragged it through the dirt. And it's still brand new. I just want one more. Oh, the same one? <laughs> Duplicates? You want to have two of the same purse? I bought two last time. A month ago? Uh, two weeks ago? Like, when was. <laughs> Guess it have to be longer than two weeks. It'd be like three, four weeks ago. Yeah, like a month ago. You did two last time. And they, are they still brand new as well? Like I've stopped all this just to talk about you and your purses. This is why you know you're VIP. I have to give you the attention that you so crave. Yeah, two weeks ago. What the fuck? This is nuts. Put your mother on. I'm going to tell her to take away your paycheck. Yes, brand new. You don't even need any more purses. Like, come on. Are they like different brands? Are they all the Are they all the same brands? Like exact same purse? Like duplicates? I mean, holy shit. Yes, I love the touch. <laughs> I mean, holy cow. <laughs> they better be different brands, different colors, different shapes and sizes. I mean, I, I, mean, I get the whole, like, you got multiple outfits, but you would think you'd, like, buy one purse to, like, match them all or match most and then maybe have a second one if you need but like you're talking like four purses I don't know I don't know I just I don't know unless your mother is the one encouraging this she needs to take away your paycheck otherwise I need to talk to your father see you just need to buy a really big one like just it's almost like a handbag, you know? It's like those big canvas fucking bags, and you just call it a purse. Oh, I'm sure clothes shopping is fun. Women. Just joking. <laughs> there goes all, there's, goes all my women audience right there. I, like, lose 100 followers if I had that many. I just... I don't know what I'm going to do with you, love chick. This is crazy. I think you have a problem. You may not think it's a problem, but he still wants me to talk to him? This guy's a lot to say. I don't think I ever told you this, but I was actually on the path to being a ranger once. Did the whole boot camp thing. Even got rookie status. Anyway, not the point. My old ranger squad was a great bunch. There was six plus me. Remus, Hazard, Cho, well, Guy, that's not Hedges, good. Stolen, Thompson. They were supposed to get back from an expedition yesterday. We had ears and wings planned. Problem is, I seem to be streaming. Okay. Darling handed out the HRAs. Then they had nothing protecting them from the hiss. You see, they prepped for the worst, but I think that we we're already past that. We all wore these pouches around our neck, and I really don't want the hiss to get them. Could you find them for me? Uh, the squad would have come back through maintenance, but they probably spread out from there. I'll keep an eye out for them, Arish. Then I won't let them stay hiss. Arish. His name is pronounced Arish. I have to go. I won't remember that next time You're I play this. Busy, you know. I'm gonna shoot that guy if he says that again. Remember, we got this. Yeah, it wasn't freezing at all. I was just like paused the game and I was like, and then unless you think that it was like something on your end. Sorry, I'm a little crazy right now. I don't know what's up with me. Missions, research. Oh shit. This one's got 12 minutes left on it. <laughs> a 
of essential research. I think I could do that. Nah, research. Have you drunk coffee? No, I don't drink coffee. I uh, can't. I mean, I do once in a blue, but I don't. It gives me a lot of uh, acid reflux because I'm an old fucking man. <laughs> Probably too old to be playing video games. No, I don't know if that's ever true. Alright, where am I going? Destroy the hiss nodes. I forgot I can fly now. I'll just go shopping next paycheck, but for now, uh, I'll just shop for other things. <laughs> ancient cosmetics. Well, the cosmetics come from ancient Egypt. They're made of this, like, powder. You make out of dirt. We grind it for you. We send it in a pouch. <laughs> ancient makeup. The makeup that... Your great 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 grandmother used to wear. Who's shooting at me? Where you at, you little shit? There you are. friend excuse me while I fly I gotta learn to fly I should have been better at that. Yeah, they sold stuff out. Stuff sold out fast. It's going to be the worst of the worst that's left over. And you're going to have to wear it. Because I think that should be your punishment for buying stuff all the time. Well, I uh, effed up that little mission thing, so let's get move on now. Speak with Dylan. I haven't spoken with Dylan yet. Alright, whatever. Oh, let's 
see. Energy? Yeah, I could use more of that. Astral constructs. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're laughing, but <clears throat> I'm trying to be serious. As your elder, you should respect what I have to say. Do you wear closed toed shoes? Because <laughs> if you do. people staring at your feet like when I walk up to a girl I just like immediately I'm like man look at those feet they better be polished <laughs> and exfoliated ooh that's one smooth foot you got there babe What's the first thing guys notice about me in a dating profile? My feet! Sorry. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> when I wear my sandals, I just put on my sandals. Damn, is he down here? Where the hell am I supposed to go? Oh, he's upstairs. what she said <laughs> yeah I don't know it's like you gotta like keep yourself together or otherwise you're gonna fall apart What are you saying? You're looking for lipo and stuff like that kind of work? Are you looking to get that done? I, I doubt you need it. You should be happy with who you are. Just my opinion. No offense or anything. If I said anything, that's offensive. here before all right uh with on the upper level Marshall abandons us <laughs> Do 
do I need to go to the upper levels? Did you hear that the his prisoner they captured is the director's brother? Brother? And she brought him here? Gonna get us all killed. What if she's working with the head case? Have you guys seen my brother Dylan? They said he was on the upper level, but it won't mark it for me. Hmm. It's like supposed to be right here. Out the elevator's gonna help. Screw you, lady. There is no upper section. I'm in the upper section. This is Lynn Salvador, head of Bureau Security. I'm making a formal security order due to the incident in April. Case number. 21HQ593. Improper use of the jukebox altered item led to two fatalities. We believe a pair of agents used the jukebox to travel to the quarry threshold and engage in illicit workplace behavior. Oh, inappropriate. An expedition team found them decomposing at the formation. They're having an orgy. At least we found out the jukebox doesn't bring corpses back when the song ends. I'm having the jukebox placed in a secure location in the executive sector. It should never have been accessible to low clearance staff in the first place. The new location security and proximity to a high traffic area will prevent misuse while still allowing for expedition teams to access it when required. See me for any further details. No, you'll see me for any further details, buddy. I'm the director. I want this pick up. Whatever. Weapon mod shouldn't be full at the moment. More radio? That's a picture. Oh, is this where he's at? That's a jukebox. Executive central executive. Makes no sense. <clears throat> Okay, well I found the jukebox, but I didn't find my brother Dylan. What's wrong with these people? Where the hell is he? Maybe he's up in one of these areas? It's like an office. Oh, wait, that's him. Distorts you. Happiness comes white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror, you heard his name right. Leave your insides by the door. Push the thing through the surface into the way. You've always been a mirror. You are this betrayal. We stand around you while you're freezing on my end. Hear our words, but you forget. All right, good luck. You are a harm 
you die. Shit. I'm just going to restore it to you. That's Dylan. Why the purpose Can you hear me? In the eye. You oh, come on, Dylan. I'm here. I found you. You lost them in there. You lost the control. Do you know who I am? Oh, you know me. Say it. You are Dylan Faden's sister. He's talking in the third person. Always a good sign. Yeah. Do you know who you are? Not Dylan. Trench and Darling made sure of that. I'm P6. P6. But I'm better now. The hiss made me better. Push the fingers through the surface and into the wet. You've always been the new you. You want this to be true. Can you stop that? Please. <sighs> Not exactly the reunion I'd hoped for. It feels good to say those words. I want to say them. They sound good. <laughs> they make me feel good. Don't you want to say them too? No. Fuck off, no. You need to help me get this thing out of his head. If he is still in there, if there is anything left, you have to you. help me. You! You came in through the hole in you! We let you in! You've always been here! The only child of a copy of a copy of a copy of a copy! Stop it! Orange peel! Shit! Shit! He can see you. This is not safe. We found Polaris together with my sister when we were very small. In ordinary. In the desert. Through the door opened up by the slide projector. But she didn't help when Trunch took me away. She didn't give me any powers. All the powers are my own powers. And she didn't help when they locked me up for years. To the song time for a pause. You till nothing remains. The air cracks and the truth will march out of you. You are home. The Bureau brought the slide projector back here with me. And the Bureau did what the Bureau does. They used it. And they found... They opened the door up to the hiss. That's the only thing I can thank them for. There. There it is. We stopped the Altered World event in Ordinary when we shut down the slide projector. And now the projector's here. I'm your warm as a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. Baby, baby, baby. Yeah. What in the world? Just plastic. So steady. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Funny. I welcomed the hiss. I let it in. To get rid of her. The hiss set me free. Polaris is using you. The Bureau is using you. You are a puppet. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. If we shut this off the slide way. projector, maybe, maybe that will stop the hiss. Maybe it's not too late for my brother. You must see the truth for yourself, Jesse. Sister. The horrible truth about the Bureau. The hiss is the better option. <laughs> Go to the prime candidate program in the containment sector. I have the key card to get you there. Salvador wanted me to have it. Wanted? Bullshit. I saw what the hiss did to Salvador. What it turned him into. Okay, Dylan. I'll go. I want to see the truth for myself. I'll go. But only to look for this lie projector. Yeah, that's what you're telling you yourself. We can end this. Currents level six. Not more to say? I don't know what else I'm hoping to find here. Dylan. 
Can we talk? I'd like to tell you about a dream I had last night. Off to a good start. Okay. I'm listening. I was back in ordinary before all of this happened. But in the dream, I was alone. It was just me. I was the only child. A girl. My name was Jesse Dylan Faden. But then the Bureau came and caught me, brought me back here, locked me up. Have you ever noticed that our names, Jesse, <coughs> Dylan, could be girls' names, boys' names, could be anything? Don't you find that weird? I find that weird. I find that weird. Sure. What the hell was that? Is he trying to mess with me? It's still flashing red. Maybe Dylan's still in there. Maybe there's a way to reach him. I'd like to talk to my brother, please. Dylan? Dylan would like to tell you about a dream he had just now. This again? I was going to be the new director of this place. I helped you get a job here so that we could be together. You were an office assistant. You'd make coffee and deliver the mail. And there was always plenty of work to do. And it stayed that way forever and ever. It was nice. Really nice. That's debatable. But here's the strange thing. The dream shifted. And none of it was real anymore. It was a game. We were in a game. And it was a fucking boring game. <laughs> but you couldn't stop playing. And then it shifted again. Or, or maybe it was another dream already. Or, or maybe I'm just confusing them. But in this other dream, it was more like a musical. This is an ordinary song about an ordinary girl from an ordinary town. It's the ordinary story. She worked an ordinary job in an ordinary office. Something, something, something. Crazy. And that's all I can remember of that dream. Maybe that's for the best. <laughs> Will it ever stop flashing red? Maybe I can learn more about the hiss from him. Can we talk? I just had an interesting dream. Oh, shit. That's fascinating, but let's talk about the hiss for a change, yeah? This dream was about the hiss. Uh, that's what I'm gonna get. In my dream, the hiss had broken free of this prison, this house. I'd set it free. And the president himself was there to welcome us. He was the first one to take the hiss in. Spread the word. At first, many people thought it was horrifying. That he was horrifying. But also, many people who heard his words wanted to welcome the hiss in. <laughs> and slowly, more and more of them came around until the whole world was brought together by the hiss. It was wonderful. Okay, thanks for sharing that. For the record, that will never happen. Not as long as I'm alive. 
I'm beginning to think this red little marker is never gonna go away. Maybe I'm just here to punish myself. Any new dreams you'd like to share, Dylan? I'm glad you asked, sister. This dream, like all dreams now, felt very real. Like reality. And reality now feels like a dream. Maybe it's all a dream. Maybe it's all real. Dream where my brother endlessly tells me about his dreams. <laughs> I was in a dark place, and there was a dark man there. His name was Mr. Door, and he told me that there are many worlds, side by side, on top of each other, some inside of others. In one world, there was a writer who wrote a story about a cop. In another world, the cop was real. Dor said he himself was in all of them at the same time, endlessly shifting between them. I asked him how I could reach these worlds. I wanted to bring the hiss there. But he didn't want to help me. He didn't like the idea. <laughs> what did he know? I'm not wild about the idea myself. All right, I'm gonna walk away from him right now. Moving on.
Hey Green, how you doing man? 07? Oh, I don't know what that is. You're gonna have to explain this strange language to me. <laughs> Trying to kick some ass at this game for a couple hours. Well, I don't know how long, much longer I'll be at it. Maybe another 30 to 45 minutes. What the fuck am I gonna do now? I want to put a token in the jukebox. Challenging expedition that grants high rewards. This will be interesting. I've never done one of these. Investigate and clear the four island sites. Okay.
Hmm. Okay. Fail that expedition. I'll have to find more tokens, I guess. I really suck at those, like, little timed challenges. I don't know why. Right, because I'm like, oh, I'll replay it. Oh, damn, no, wait, it's a one-try thing. Oh. Shit, it's not. Okay, cool. Maybe I should pick up better weapons. Uh... I don't know what the hell these assets are going to do for me. Where's our buddy? Did I cleanse this one already? us. Fuck me, I hate those things.
One more wave. Bam. Damn it. It's the last wave. If I can just beat that douche. <laughs> He's a douche. Alright. Attempt, I guess. Damn, I'm gonna go through the whole thing.
Well, since uh, my viewership kind of dropped at the moment, I'm going to go ahead and probably cut out here. I'll pick up control later. Um, I kind of just play it as, as I do. You know, it's not really like a set level that I complete or anything. Um, I will be uploading yesterday's gameplay of um, Wolfenstein to our YouTube, which is under the Legion. It's also on my video on demand on my Twitch. Obviously a lot easier to find. If you are watching these videos on YouTube, um, I am LGN Smoke, and you can find my Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash LGN Smoke. And uh, feel free to hit that follow button, turn on notifications, that way you know when I'm going live. I will be trying to stream later today, um, thinking maybe within an hour, maybe two, I should be back um, and be able to stream. And I will be playing Wolfenstein, uh, the new Colossus, and we'll go from there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and exit out of this. I just want to thank everybody for stopping by. Thank you, Love Chick, for popping in like always. Um, you're awesome to talk to. Uh, sorry I gave you a hard time about shopping, but, you know, I'm just teasing you. But anyways, guys, um, I will catch you soon. Hopefully I'll be back on later tonight. And uh, just everyone have a great rest of your Friday, and I'll talk to you later.